Jimbo, John Gaffney, Roger Ayers, and uh, the scramble. St. Francis comes up with it, attacking the basket right away. And off the scramble, Terror is off to a 6 nothing lead. Crawford from the corner, and he answers with a three. Now they go to Thompson for three, and Thompson able to hit from the top of the arc. Now in traffic, and Milk got a shot blocked. And tonight, he's put on a real passing exhibition. Crawford on the baseline. He's able to hit. Sherno lets it fly, and he hits a three. That was almost NBA range. Boy, they still move that ball. On the backcourt yeah. cut, beautifully done. Nice feed by Crawford. Thompson dumps it down low to Crawford. Step back jumper is good. Crawford very confident. Terriers at all. They just kept control, got right to the paint, and laid it up. Nice feed down low. And slipping on the logo at center court. They get it to Crawford deep in the corner. Lane drive. Triple by Crawford. And Thompson finally ends up with it. He's able to drill one. Betcha. 12 to 2 run. And the Terriers are tough defensively. They're not easy. Trying to take the ball out of Bennett's hands with a double team and another turnover. St. Francis struggling in that category. Seven of them. Thompson hard to the basket, lays it up and in. And he does not give it up. Get it down low to Johnson. So another Al Harrington sighting against that Princeton attack. He really opened up gigantic holes. And the troubles continue outside. Ball stolen by Michael Thompson. Thompson feeds Crawford. Sherna fires and he drills it. <laughs> but Northwestern continues to push the tempo. Wild shot goes in. When Norm Roberts was let go at St. John's, Crawford's line drive three again. Ninth turnover by Northwestern. Zalewski went to the basket and now a whistle blows. Crawford has it, 10 to shoot. They dump it down low to Murkovich. Goes to the left hand, missed it, but it's tipped once, twice. Crawford on the drive, and the baseline fadeaway is good. Crawford with a big bucket. Got to go inside, Northwestern, yes. Trying to stay unblemished. Sherna steals. Can't oh, save it, does oh, save it. Does. Thompson on the move. Down the paint. Feeds Crawford. Count the bucket. Give him a free throw. Crawford and company. They were here last year, lost to the champion in overtime in the first round, plus to Cornell. So his Thompson goes hard to the goal, banks it high off the glass. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. He just hasn't gotten into a rhythm tonight. Like he just oh, nice. great yeah. back to work cut. And a nice feed that time by Alex Marcatulio on MSG. The holiday festival presented by Foot Locker and Sherman now shredding the St. Francis defense. Dives inside, lost the dribble, and uh, Wildcats come up with it. They got numbers. Ahead of the field, it's Cobb for an easy layoff. Tex winner, and uh, Bill Foster, who coached at Rutgers and Duke, you know, they... Scherner got away with one. Crawford down the baseline, feeds Scherner, and he's able to lay it up and in. Respect in the NBA. I wouldn't be surprised if they made considerations here. Another breakaway. Oh, nice feed to Scherner oh, yeah. for Duncan. How about that for unselfish play? In the second half, does that tell you something about offensive efficiency? Scherner makes him pay. Players and officials, and we do have one from baseball. As Callaway's shot goes in and out. And out on the break, Scherner will make the catch and lay it in. But he never umps his games. You can't have that. And Scherner will steal, go in, and he lost the ball, regains it. And it's blocked, got it back, put it in. I mean, this yeah. group is going to yeah. make some history, it looks like. I think they'll get six more wins before this is over. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think. Off the back door, they work it. 18 to shoot. Cobb gets a look at it, and he's able to hit. That's a three-pointer and a timeout. It's noon at Purdue, 11 in Chicago. That's uh, that's the time difference there. Second time this year, they've gone over 90. They had 91 against Georgia Tech, as we mentioned. Everybody getting involved. Line misses. And they get another layup missed and tipped in. Falls here tonight, 92-61. In the opener of the Holiday Festival presented by Foot Locker. John Scherner with 26. The Wildcats' first win at MSG since 1966, a two-pointer 
over St. John's. Bill Carmody and company will be back tomorrow night for the championship game. Drew Crawford with 25, John Sherman with 26. 51 of the 92 coming from those two. Northwestern 92, St. Francis 61 as the Wildcats put on an offensive display and get themselves to the championship round.